What's going on, y'all? It's Eric. I just want to let y'all know, November 20th, we're dropping a new single called 8 p.m. slash Cuffing Season um, with my friend Jules. Make sure y'all go pre-save it. The link is in the description. Hope you guys enjoy. Later. What Yo, is going, going on? Welcome back to another mock Dang. And today, I've got something a little special. We're throwing it back. I got a little something special for this Let's guy. Get it, uh... This guy right here. <laughs> today... We're going traditional today. we going traditional. And I'm about to get it right now. And, you know, back to our roots. Um, as you know, or as you can see, we're both Filipino. And today, we got something very special for y'all. Some got... chicken goddamn... Holy f I almost spilt it. <laughs> Adobes. Adobo, baby. Okay. Look at that. No, no, don't. Yeah, 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 that's good, yeah. Look at that. Bro, the smell is Oof. It's crazy. Look at that, baby. Just look it's at that shit. Shaking, bro. All right. Let's go. All right. We are going to eat some chicken adobo. Mm -hmm. Cooked it up real quick for the homie. <laughs> I'm so excited. This is one of my favorite Filipino dishes um, of all time. I think I would say the same. I think I really f with the chicken adobo with the, the sauce and the actual protein itself. So let me just serve you up real quick, brother. Let me just put that up. Boom. Jeez, this guy's a shot. Look at that. Then, hold on, hold on. Fucking <laughs> dead. Jeez, this guy's making it lobby. There you go. Yo. That is some gourmet shit right there, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, yeah, get that zoom in. Yup. Ooh. Mint. Let me just serve myself here. There you go. Pour it up, brother. Pour it up, pour it up. How much shall we buy out? You want more sauce? Feel free, bro. Wait, wait, wait. I got sauce. I got it this, uh... The sauce is Perfect where right. it's out. Alright. Alright, yo. Cheers to the Philippines. <laughs> Shout outs to y'all. Thank y'all for making such an amazing dish. Cheers. Oh my god. Cheers. Woo! Woo! Alright. Mm hmm. So, how do you make this? Mm hmm. This is like really good. Oh. Oh, let me just over here. Very simple. Very simple, very easy. Step by step process. Put to the side a bowl of ingredients that you want to mix in. You put soy sauce, you put vinegar, you put a bit of water in there as well, some black pepper, some sugar. Um, you put chopped garlic. Oh, shit. Sure. Um, what else? That's pretty much it. You put that all leaf. together. There's like a big leaf in here. You put it all together. You want to sear the chicken first. Oh, you can see that. There's like a big ass leaf. Bay leaf. Mm -hmm. Yo, this is hitting, bro. That's hot as fuck. You want to sear the chicken first? Let that sear to five to ten minutes. Later on, place the um, mixture of ingredients in. And there you have it. Oh my god. It's like... Mm -hmm. The chicken is like cooked so tenderly. Mm -hmm. Super juicy. Cooked beautifully. I love the uh, the sourness of the... Uh, yeah. The sort of dressing. The tanginess of there? The tanginess, yeah. That, that's, the, that's the vinegar. That comes into play. Mm hmm. The even, the, even the sauce. Mm hmm. That you kind of like on there. boil it. Mm hmm. Some crazy flavor we got going. Let me show you up another one, brother. This is so good. Perfect. Thanks, bro. You don't have to do that, man. You know, I'm just trying to 
Yeah. You know, serve it up. Have hospitality out here. Hey, you want some juice? Nah, I'm good. <laughs> Not too much juice. Too much juice. This is nice and garlicky. Juice. Mm. Nice and garlicky, nice and fresh. Yes, sir. Absolutely. You garnish it off with some some parsley. Game over. You don't want to eat the bay leaf, though. Unless you want to, go ahead. But I don't eat bay leaves. Oh, uh, you know what? The stupid fan was on the whole time, bro. <laughs> All this right. is so good. Go. Mm hmm. Mm. It just got so quiet. It really gets here. Your mm. sense is going. That's for sure. It's a really good meal. Do you fuck with. Okay, what other Filipino dishes do you like? Um. Hmm. That's a great question. Here's the thing. I don't. I don't normally eat Filipino dishes. However. I don't know, it's fucking weird because I'm Filipino. <laughs> um, however, I do like adobo. I don't know, any meat, Filipino meat dishes, I think is, um, is fire. As long as there's meat, seasoned meat, marinated meat. Mm. The barbecue kebabs, always fire. Ooh. Always Bio, fire. I think, in my opinion, the number one... Filipino dish. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yo, Lunganisa, bro. Jeez. Rice in the morning. Yup. Egg. Yup. Yo, that might have to be another episode. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I'm down. A morning a, episode. A Filipino breakfast. Mm -hmm. Episode. Yeah, bro. I'm down for that. Oh, this is super fire. Yo. Where'd you learn this recipe? I actually got it on YouTube. I forgot who, honestly, sorry, because I forgot who made the recipe, but <laughs> honestly, I here's what I do. I look at other recipes on YouTube, and then you take whatever you want on each, and then just apply on your own, and then it's your own take, and then so there you figure go. Figure it out. Pretty much. Fucking, it works. Mm -hmm. It's just so magical. Tasty, tender. Fox. I like how like the meat is uh And the rice to bounce it all out. Yeah, it like spaces mm -hmm. it out. Mm-hmm. Oh, we got big chunks. What's up? Um You got a lot of flavor with the chicken. Yeah. So then the rice kind of like makes it not as intense. As that makes right. It makes it like it's like a burger and bread, you know. Mm -hmm. Right. And really hitting the spot, though. Thanks. Dangerously good. Mm -hmm. I, I haven't been talking about <laughs> how fire this was. You know it's good, bro. Trust. Cheers, man. Mm hmm. If you've never tried this dish, make sure you go to a Filipino restaurant, wherever. Or do it at home. Or make it at home. Super easy. Chicken adobo. Just YouTube it. It's super, super good. Um, Man, yeah, you have to try it. It's definitely like a Filipino staple. Oh yeah, for sure. Like, um, you have to... Uh, this is so good. What do you rate it? Um, hmm. 
Mm. Obviously, because I cooked it. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be honest with myself. Mm. <laughs> I'm gonna give it a um, 7.8. Yeah? Mm hmm. Um, reason being. I think at a very, very, this is just at a very basic, basic, simple, easy level. I'm sure that there, there I can marinate the chicken maybe and maybe that'll enhance the, you know what I mean? That'll de enhance the flavors and shit like that. But mm. like, as it stands, the cooking process, everything in general, taste, combination with the rice, 7.5, easy. Right. Let's say like, let's say an eight. Mm -hmm. Let's say an eight. This is like, I love the flavors. It's very unique. You don't, mm -hmm. you don't know how have this type of flavor often. I'm not sure Filipino. They didn't have it every day. But, um, yeah, this is super. Good. Yeah, we only have this once in a while. Um. You can have it every day if you want, but I mean, it's not, it's not when necessarily. When you fish it out, you have like, you appreciate the fish more. Exactly. I think that's what it is, yeah. That's true as fuck. Mm -hmm. What's your, what do you like the most out of it? For me, I think it's the garlic. The garlic is what? I think the garlic brings out a lot of the, uh, mm -hmm. well, I mean like, I just like garlic itself. Mm -hmm. um, but I love the chicken. I love the tenderness of like each bite it's like super soft it's not dry um and then with the sauce it just makes it more like juicy yeah. and then the rice kind of yeah like i said before it spaces it out right that makes sense it kind of not blends it out but would you okay but would you would you think it would be better if it was fried rice or would you leave it that way right Ooh, that's tough i mean i like fried rice Mm -hmm. But I like, I also like just regular rice. Mm -hmm. too. Mm -hmm. So I feel like regular rice with the gobo is like mm -hmm. perfect in itself, you know? Yeah. Less is more sometimes, you know? No, I agree. Like, I think this, on, this only goes well with white rice. I'm gonna say it here. You say weird? I mean, garlic fried rice is fire too, but because you have that sauce, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah. That yeah. sauce from, that, from the adobo, it just. You wouldn't need fried rice. Hmm? You wouldn't need fried rice. Yes, sir. And now this is a Filipino technique. Well, if you have a spoon, it's like a shovel. <laughs> that was chicken and bobo, guys. Um, I think it was amazing. I thought it was good. I think y'all should try it if y'all have never tried it. Um, it's flavorful. Right? It's flavorful. It's powerful. It's everything you can ever ask for in a Filipino dish. Top it off with some parsley. Some halal for dessert. <laughs> <laughs> That's another thing we should do. I don't know how to make that though. <laughs> no, I'll have to buy it. We'll have to buy it or we'll have to um, make it ourselves and figure it how. Yeah. Figure out how to do it. Sure. But anyways. Anyways. Thank y'all for watching. We had a blast. We're going to end it Last off here. Cool. Thank you guys for coming and tuning into another episode. We'll see you guys on the next one. And I hope you guys enjoyed this one because this one. Stay safe. Wash your hands. This one was Don't fire. Don't face like me. Love you guys. Later, y'all. Peace. <laughs> <laughs>